What's up, ladies and gentlemen? It's 88 Killer Live from the Funk, your favorite rapper's favorite rapper to hate on on Facebook. We are here live in the main streets of Fort Worth, Texas. You can see there's no litter. It's clean out here because that's how we do in a real city. Dallas, catch up. I'm out here going to ask a couple of citizens what they feel about whatever people are fake caring about online. We're only going to give them 20 seconds because this isn't your status, all right? We're going to keep scrolling, B. Then after that, I'm going to figure out what they do for a living how much money they have in these savings. I'm just gonna kind of guess because I'm an OG and I know everything. So if you should follow along, bookmark this right here, gather around and follow us. Panther City Propaganda, 88 Killer, let's go. What's your name and where you're from? I'm John and I'm from Austin. All right, Austin in the house, keep Austin weird. The first question, how you feel about Jason Garrett real quick? I can ask cuss, I hate him. Yeah, yeah. He should have been fired two years ago. Fuck Jason Garrett. All right. Do you think there's any truth to any of the Jeffrey Epstein memes? Yeah, there's always truth to memes, for sure. Always truth to memes. <laughs> yes, sir. <laughs> All right. As a black man, do you feel comfortable when you see the words back the blue in a restaurant? Hell no. <laughs> but no, no safety, nothing. I feel very uncomfortable. Aw, oh, damn. The blue, what's up, man? <laughs> Protect us too, bro. Hey, All, right. Up, bro? All right, so now I'm going to try to guess three things about you. Are okay. you ready? Please do. I'm going to try to guess your occupation. Oh. Are you? All right, let me see. Hmm. You look like the top accountant on the fourth floor. I am not an accountant. Oh, what are you? I do like recruitment consulting. Mm, sounds intense. All right. You have at least $613.38 in your savings account. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I got seven right here. Yeah. So. That's my man. All right, all right. And the last, you drive a Mustang with the service engine light on. Ah. Uh, my service light is on. I'm in the Mazda 6, though. I'm in the Mazda uh, yeah. 6. Shout out to the service engine light. We out here. We appreciate you, man. I got you, Th big thank dog. You. Let's go. All right, tell the people what's your name and where you're from. I am Peyton Holland, and I am from Arlington, Texas. Ooh, shout out Arlington UTA in the building. All right, the first question Which one of Kylie Jenner's ex boyfriends would you let take you out on a date? I don't care about Kylie Jenner. Yeah, her boyfriends, though. I don't know any besides Travis Scott and who else was it? There's Tyga. Tyga, that's right, yeah. All right, so, Kylie, you don't get respect out here in these streets. <laughs> right. no, I just don't well, keep up with it. That's, I mean, that's everybody keeps up with the Kardashians, hence the name. Eh. All right, all right. <laughs> Kylie, you got to do better. You're missing fans out here in Arlington. <laughs> all right. Oh, wait, I guess Travis Scott because he's from Houston, from Texas. Mm, that's very important. Okay. Have you ever dated a black man? Um, no, I prefer Hispanics. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah. Be uh, oh, what? Oh, okay, <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Hmm. Damn, you got me stumped right now. You don't like... Okay. In a bar fight between me. Rihanna, oh, Kaylani, and Beyonce, who would come out on top? Beyonce's like the queen, but I feel like Rihanna throws down. Mm. I feel like Rihanna throws down. So no love for Kaylani. She just no. There's love. There's love for all of them. <laughs> but I I just have a feeling that Rihanna throws down. All right, cool. All right, so I'm gonna guess. Hmm. Let me see. All right. For your occupation. Okay. You are a physical therapist. I wish <laughs> I'd make more money. <laughs> no, I am in sales. Sales, okay, sales, okay. So what that means, you drive a Camaro. No, I'm driving the same car from high school because I don't want to pay for my own. <laughs> no. Which was a Camaro. No, it's a right. Toyota 4Runner. It's pretty respectable out here in these streets. Yes. All right. What the streets? <laughs> All right. Um, hmm. You've spent well over two thousand dollars this year in makeup and beauty products i don't wear makeup mm. get that natural beauty get that natural peyton ladies and gentlemen <laughs> tell us your name and where you're from 
Brittany, Chicago. Ooh, mm -hmm. Shy City in the house. Yeah. All I right. Don't live here though. Got you. I got you. Okay, if you could <laughs> replace, or no, 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 no. If you had to sit through one opener, and it was between Keisha Cole or Carrie Hilson, who would it be? Carrie Hilson. Okay, okay. okay. Keisha Cole, she can't sing live. Oh, you've seen her live? Oh, yes. It's terrible. Keisha, we're going to need you to drink some honey, get those vocals in order, all right? All right. More than tea, baby. <laughs> all right. All right. How do you feel about McDonald's stepping on Popeye's with their own limited edition chicken sandwich? Y'all fuck McDonald's chicken sandwich and Popeye's too, low key. <laughs> Facts though. Popeyes, y'all stressing people out out there, man. Not for the be in line, shooting <laughs> folks. That shit been on the menu. Okay. Whoever y'all marketing is, you the goat. But, you know, <laughs> real shit. All right. So, if you've seen these two people fighting in the street, who would you help and, like, help them? Kaylani, Doja Cat, or Rihanna? I'm fucking with Rihanna all day. <laughs> <laughs> Bitch, let me get the 50 coins with me through. Yeah. Let me win this fight. Yo, it's Christmas, Rihanna. Come on, help. I'm trying to get some presents too. You feel me? Bitch, all right. Get a bra some. All right, so now I'm going to try to guess three things about you. You ready? Okay, all right, I'm going to try to guess your occupation real quick. You give me the vibes of a middle school teacher. <laughs> no, I'm just a real ass nigga. <laughs> we need those in the school system, though. <laughs> all right, all right. <laughs> we need. All right, let's see. Mm. You threw me for a loop on that one. I wasn't prepared. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, I'm trying to guess what you drive real quick. I feel like you drive a Nissan Maxima. Bitch, you petty as fuck. That's a nice car. What, what you drive? I drive, um, right. Oh, damn, I disrespected her. That's my bad, y'all. My That's bad. Baby mama car. You gave me the baby mama car, though. It's a nice economic vehicle. That's the, a fucking baby mama yo, car. Yo, the, uh, the economy is a little shaky right now. Right. And you could be a baby. I don't know. I don't. This is all a guess. I, I, all right, all right, I, get all right. I get it. I get it. Maybe the, I'm putting out the wrong vibes. This nah. is a good conversation to be having. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, let's see. I think. Man, the third question. You're a challenge. Let's see. Hmm. Hmm. You spent over two thousand dollars in beauty products. Um. Actually, no, sir. That's incorrect. I use Dove Sensitive Skin and Cerave on my face. Oh, is it Cerave, Cerave, whatever? <laughs> that part. And you know, I just wash my coochie and I be good. That's that's, that's very important. <laughs> Everything else is natural. All right. Back to you. <laughs> What's up? We are here with, remind me your name again? Bailey. Bailey. All right, Bailey, are you ready for the questions? Yes. Did you wake up this morning and stand in line for Bed Bath & Beyond's candle sale? Uh, Bath & Body Works? No. That one? No. Why not? <laughs> there were $8 work. a candle. I know. <laughs> All right. They were um, $9. If you could have one beauty influencer do your makeup live on YouTube, who would it be? James Charles. Mm, shout out to the sisters. Yeah, I think I knew about that. All right, my last question is how do you feel about the Popeye's chicken sandwich? I haven't had it. Damn it. All right, so now I'm going to try to guess three things about you. Are you ready? Yes. I'm going to guess your occupation. You are a veterinarian. No, I'm bartender. Bartender. That's the same thing. Yeah. <laughs> you got to be controlling of who lets the dogs out. All right, your second, my second guess. You have over five hundred dollars in savings no <laughs> not even close all right okay my third guess you drive a white jeep <laughs> no i wish <laughs> damn it i'm, I'm over two out here in these streets <laughs> all right tell the people your name and where you're from Connor, Fort Worth, Texas. Mm, shout out Fort Worth in the building, the clean streets of Fort Worth. We out here. All right, how do you feel about The Irishman? The movie? Yeah, the movie. Netflix. Yeah. That's tight. That, that's tight? That's how you feel about it? It took me like four days to watch it, yeah, but... I feel you. <laughs> All right. If you had the chance to go on a date with Kylie Jenner or Jordan Woods or Gwen Stefani or Kaylani. Or Carly Rae Jepsen. Oh, no, that does last too well. 
Call Me Maybe. She had a joint back yeah. in the day. All right, so, not, so she's a loser. You don't want to go on a date with her. Same thing. Okay. All right, so Rihanna and who else I said? I didn't even say Rihanna. Kylie Jenner. Kylie Jenner. Jordan Woods. All right. Gwen Stefani and Kate, Carly Rae Jepsen. Yeah, where would you take them and which one? Uh, Kylie Jenner because she's most fucking rich. All right, where would you take her on a first date? Outback Steakhouse. Mmm, top shelf right there. <laughs> Kylie, get at your mans right here. All right. Steakhouse. How do you feel about McDonald's stepping on Popeye's trying to come out with their own limited edition chicken sandwich? Dude, I like the hot and spicy McChicken. That's fire. It's real economical. But I can never cheat on my Chick-fil-A. Oh, Chick-fil-A. They always serve you with a smile. All right, so now I'm going to try to guess three things about you. You ready? All right. All right, I'm going to try to guess your occupation. You look like a bookkeeper at the Fort Worth Public Library. I wish. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's see. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> You spent, you spent well over three thousand dollars in craft beer this year. Ah, shit! You ain't, you ain't wrong about that one. <laughs> All right, you drive. Mm, what do you drive? Something with some class. A Ford Taurus. I ain't classy. <laughs> so I was wrong. Yeah. Oh man. Well. I'm 0 for 3 out here in these streets. No, I'm 1 for 4 with my guesses. What do you drive? Grand Cherokee. The same thing. No, <laughs> no it's not. <laughs> Shout out to the Grand Cherokees. Hold it down out there in these streets. Be safe. Important that they see me, push my fingers, rep the town.